And up last, Shady Oasis. Another level I'm not going to be able to finish in the first go-round. Like this. If you get in front of him, he'll hurt. He won't hurt you, but he will knock you down. Peacocks are the fodder animals of this level. Yeah, I may, uh, since it runs generally well enough on my PC, I may very well eventually do the uh, Prince of Persia series. Well, the 3D Prince of Persia. I ain't playing that uh, uh, fucking 2D dungeon crawler one. I tried to a long time ago, and I, I just did not have fun. But... Uh, Prince of Persia, Sands of Time, Two Warriors, or uh, Warrior Within, Two Thrones, etc. Yeah, those I'll probably uh, do at some point. So those guys have shields that you actually have to bash off before you can hurt them. Stay out of his way, Peacock. And killing you would still count towards me having to damage myself. So, this level loops in on itself quite a lot. actually don't really need to because the power up that you need for it leads to a mini game that I can't do until I get the next ability. I swear every time I hear fodder animals make sounds I think something accidentally killed one of them. self-explanatory, but to uh, knock that one down, we had to launch something at it. And we've made it to the end. Thanks for helping me reach the great berry bush. Now we can eat berries all the time. Here, take this. It's a gift from all of us hippos. Finish collecting up everything I can. Spyro, three thieves have stolen our magical brass lamps. 
please get the lamps before they take them away from Shady Oasis. <laughs> so we got lamp thieves and not, uh, uh, egg thieves. Careful on how you jump there. One. See another one over there, but I'll get that in a minute. I didn't want to go up the whirlwind. Spyro, my brothers have been trapped in solid rock. I'm afraid you'll need to learn some kind of head bash move before you can help us. Yeah, we need the head bash to fully get everything in this place. But I can still go in this to grab these two over here. Because that will damage you. Let's grab the mystery pot first. And now we go for the chase. These guys are much easier to catch than the, uh... Egg Thieves of Spyro 1. Might take you a few loops, but comparative to how quickly those assholes moved, these guys are just generally so much easier. Grab these. All right. And the last one is halfway through the level. Once so I grab that, that's all I can... Uh, that and this, that'll be all I can collect here. So let's grab this first, then the lamp guy, because the lamp guy will teleport us right to the end. So that's all the gems I can get. Last one is those lamp thieves are up this way, if I'm remembering correctly. Almost ran right into them. Yep, there it is. So if you try to head him off like that, he will backtrack on himself. Lamp number three teleports Thanks us right back to the back exit. Magic lamps. Here, take this orb. Some fairy left it with me, but it won't hold a proper shine. Alrighty, Rue, that's all we can do here, so out we go. see y'all next time for the boss fight.